Most plants have leaves, and the leaves come in all shapes and sizes. Leaves help a plant to grow by taking in carbon dioxide and sunlight in a process that we call photosynthesis. Leaves also release oxygen and transport nutrients and water. We would like for you to take a closer look at some leaves for yourself. Find three different leaves and observe them very carefully. Write down or draw out what makes them similar, so alike, and what makes them different. Trace the leaves with a piece of paper in a crayon. Do you see the veins in the leaves? What do you think they do? Mm. In places like Indiana, when the fall comes, so do the beautiful fall colors. Have you ever wondered why the trees change color? When you eat breakfast in the morning, you get the energy you need for a fun day at school. Plants get energy in a different way. Have you ever noticed green leaves on a tree? Leaves are green because of a special green material that plants make called chlorophyll. This green material is important because it helps plants collect the energy they need from sunlight. Plants use this energy to make sugar and oxygen. We can live on the earth because of the green material and the leaves. At the end of the day, you might take a bath and put on pajamas as you get ready to go to sleep and rest. Plants rest in a different way. In the fall, there is less daylight and the temperature starts turning colder. This means the green leaves know it is time to go to bed. The green material or chlorophyll that plants have in their leaves starts to go away and the yellow, orange, brown, and red colors in the leaves are revealed. Here's an activity that you can do to model the plants changing colors in the fall. Get some filter paper and some water soluble markers. You can place colors like yellow, orange, and red as a dot on the filter paper, and then place a dot of green marker on top. You suspend these pieces of filter paper in water and let the water wick up the filter paper. And you will observe the separation of the colors, much like the colors that separate in the leaves. While you're waiting for this to happen, Closely observe a green leaf. Can you see where the leaf is starting to change its colors? 